the Adam 22 ritual has officially completed. Now, if you don't know, Adam 22 started a really unhinged reality TV show called For the Love of Lena, where a bunch of cuskers got the opportunity to slip inside of Lena the Plug's loose post-pregnancy punani live on their only fans now the winner has been chosen is some dude named lil d who apparently was already in the adult industry the whole time now i didn't know that little detail the whole time i knew about this reality tv show so i think this whole reality tv show was literally just a sales funnel or a marketing funnel rather to build hype because the last time one of the plug got you know a nice goat cheese deposit inside of her it went viral and they probably made millions so they wanted to do that again but they knew simply letting another man hit it is not going to do the same thing so they had to do this reality tv show get everybody talking about it but the whole time they knew they were going to choose Lil d now i didn't watch it i did see a clip where he they're, they're both going in and they fist bump and it's just like you know i'm trying to comprehend adam 22's brain I'm, I'm seriously trying to like think what could possibly make this worth it and i think academics is right there comes a certain point to where you have enough money you are already financially stable you got to start thinking about the finer things in life you got to start thinking about the future you got to start thinking about your family especially he has a whole daughter and, and you can't be out here moving like this this is like literally insane he doesn't realize it now, but this is going to like really impact his daughter, whatever her name is, because as messed up as it is, bro, she's going to be forced to see this. And I know you're thinking, how is that? People are going to send it to her like she might be in like private school because they damn sure can't put her in a public school. She might she might go to Home Depot and get a rope and a folding chair and a tripod and go into the forest. Not even trying to be funny, but even in a private school setting. They might just pull out their phone and show her like, bro, you can't say anything to me. Look at your mom getting absolutely demolished right here in 4K quality. You can literally see every stretch mark, every cellulite bubble. And even if they did make a lot of money off this, Lena the Plug and Adam 22 are already rich. Adam 22 doesn't even have to be on no jumper. He's just there like... I don't even know why people don't even really like him like that because of the whole Adam 16 era and the whole fig unity beef and a bunch of other things. People like all the other hosts except him. So once again, we've reached the point to where he's ruined even more of his credibility. He's pimped out his wife, the mother of his child as well, all for a little bit of money in the grand scheme of things and for the sacrifice of his child who's gonna have to face these consequences because i mean they chose to go down this lifestyle they chose to do the whole adult entertainment thing they chose to do uh their nsfw only fans or whatever they got going on but the child didn't choose and you know man overall it's just a, a sad situation when you really think about it and another thing i gotta speak on real fast that kind of also proves to me that adam 22's mind is just not right recently crit matt got arrested right and what do you think adam 22's response was to that incident take a guess right he commented on instagram miss you buddy Wuddy." so he pimps out crit matt for content knowing damn well he's not gonna let crit matt skeet inside of his wife he knew the whole time he's not gonna let that shit happen he just had him there to get the ratings up get the cloud up whatever and then promptly kick him off the show he brings him into the spotlight. He probably pays him like $35,000 a year because that's what all the Fig Unity guys said. He He's not the reason Crip Matt got arrested, but I mean, you know, he he does use Crip Mac a lot for views. And if we take what Fig Unity wrote says seriously regarding the salary that they make, he probably didn't get a whole lot of money from that whole relationship. And if you ask me, a lot of the time when Crip Mac is on that podcast, they're laughing at him instead of with him. And I don't know if Crip Mac's just not smart enough to see it or he just like is like, fuck it. Let me get the little bit of money in clout because, you know, it's either that or Crip in full time, which is probably makes you zero dollars a day. Now, despite that really weird ass comment, quote unquote, miss you, buddy, buddy from Adam. 
hopefully he gets him a lawyer so that he can get out but you know i'm not gonna completely like void accountability from crit mac he did have a gun on him he was kind of moving a little bit reckless but he's also done a lot to keep the no jumper brand clouded up and moving forward since the whole drama happened but with all that being said what do you guys think about this really ridiculous reality tv show that finally ended with adam 22 and this girl is there any amount of money that you would get paid to let your girl get viciously slayed on camera for the whole world to see whole time you have a daughter who didn't sign up to have two parents who did weird shit like that thank you guys for tuning in definitely check out my other content if you haven't like comment subscribe big viper i'm out man peace